Hello, this is going to be a tutorial of Scott LePage's uh, first solo from Polyphia's new single, Ego Death. I'm not the best at talking to cameras, uh, but I figured this would be a good way for me to give back to the community that has helped me improve my guitar playing. Uh, so I hope this helps uh, anyone out there who's looking for a tutorial on this solo. Yeah, without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so for my cover of this solo, uh, I played it on the Fender Stratocaster 6 string. Uh, with my pickup set to uh, the neck position um, when the tone turned all the way down to zero. So we start off with the first part of this solo which should sound something like this. So that's going to be 3rd fret to 5th fret on the 5th string. It's a slide, followed by 3rd fret on the 4th string. Then followed by 3rd fret to 5th fret on the 4th string. A pull off back to the third fret, then a slide back to the second fret, then followed by a fifth fret on the fourth on the fourth string, and then a second fret on the third string again. So again, it should sound like this. Okay, the next part of the solo should sound like this. So we start with the 3rd fret on the 5th string with a little vibrato followed by a 3rd fret again to a hammer on to a 5th uh, fret on the 5th string then 3rd fret to 5th fret on the 4th string 2nd fret to 3rd fret on the 3rd string repeat that one more time pull off to the 2nd fret on the same string so uh, thus far we should have this. Yeah, something like that. The next portion should be back to the 5th fret on the 5th string. 5th uh, fret to 7th fret on the 4th string. Okay, and 3rd uh, fret on the same string, which is the 4th string. 5th fret on the 5th string. So back to the 4th uh, string, 5th fret to 7th fret. Okay, 3rd fret on that same string, 4th string. 5th fret on the 5th string. And back to the 3rd fret on the 4th string. Okay. Okay, so that portion should be finished with a 1st fret on the 5th string. So thus far, we should have something like this. Okay, next we have this. Okay, so that's a slide all the way up to the 12th fret on the 4th string. 10th fret on the 3rd string. 11th fret on the 2nd string. Hammer on to the uh, 13th fret on the 2nd string. So uh, for my cover, I did uh, I played a double stop including the 3rd uh, string as well. So that's 2nd and 3rd string that I'm plucking. Pull off to the 11th fret on the 2nd string. Then the 10th fret on the same string. And then next we have a bend, a boomer bend on the 12th fret of the 3rd string. Should be a full step bend. Let it come down. Back to the 10th fret on the 3rd string before a subtle slide to the 9th, 9th fret on that same string. So it just sounds something like this. Okay, next part. So that's going to be uh, another boomer bend on the 10th fret of the 2nd string, full step, 2 in a row, um, before uh, returning to the 10th fret, and then a pull off to the 8th uh, fret on the same string. And then we have the 10th fret on the 3rd string. So that should sound like this. And then uh, we move to the 9th fret on the 3rd string. Uh, two full step bends again. 
returning to the uh, seventh fret on the third string, then slide back uh, to the sixth fret on the third string. Then um, we return to the ninth fret on the third string, and then finish up with the seventh fret on the third string. Next part. So we start off with a double stop on the first and second string, um, eighth fret with a hammer on to the tenth fret on the second string. Then uh, we move back to the eighth fret on the second string, tenth fret on the third string, seventh fret on the third string, tenth fret on the fourth string, then twelfth fret on the third string. Then uh, 10 slide to the 12th fret on the 3rd string. Then back to the 10th fret on the 3rd string as well. With vibrato. And then hammer on back to the 12th fret. Next part. Okay, so that's going to be 12th fret on the 4th string. Hammer on to the uh, 14th fret on that same string. G. Then a slide back to the 10th fret on the 4th string. Hammer on to the 12th fret on the 4th string. 10th fret on the 3rd string. Sliding twice to the 12th fret. That's the end of this portion. Next we have this. Uh, it looks like an E chord, but we have a pull off on the uh, third string. I'll show you what I mean. Okay, so we start off with this uh, E chord shape. Uh, we have the 10th fret on the third string. We have a pull off to the uh, 9th fret. Then 10th string on the 4th, sorry, 10th fret on the 4th string. And 10th fret on the second on the fifth string. Then we move back to the third string, 12th fret to 14th fret. And then we slide back to the uh, ninth fret on the third string. Next we have this. So that's going to be 10th um, fret on the 2nd string with a hammer on to the 13th fret. Then 12th uh, fret on the 3rd string. 10th fret on the 2nd string. Then that's going to be 10th uh, fret to 12th fret on the 3rd uh, string. Then 12th fret on the 4th um, string. Then 10th uh, fret on the 3rd string. Okay, so. Then we're going to repeat that two more times. Ending with a uh, 12th fret on the 3rd string. So that's going to sound like this. Okay, next. Okay, so we start with the 12th fret on the 3rd string. Hammer on to the uh, 14th fret. Repeat that. Then back to the uh, uh, 15th fret on the 3rd string. Then one more time, uh, 12th fret to the 14th fret. Okay, then we have a 12th fret to 10th fret pull off on the same string. 12th fret to 10th fret pull off on the 4th string. Then next we have 12th fret to 14th fret on the 3rd string. 14th fret on the 4th string. Sliding up to the uh, 15th fret and slide to the uh, 17th fret on the on the same string, and then we repeat that. The last part of the solo was played incredibly fast. I tried to slow down the, um, the video to ensure that I got the right notes, but I'm still not. Uh, entirely certain it's 100% accurate. So I'll teach you guys how to play it the way I did on my cover video. So it should sound something like this.
So we start with the 15th fret on the first string with a hammer on to the 17th fret. Then pull off from 17, 15 to the 13th fret. So, and then we repeat the pull off uh, sequence from the 17th fret to 15 to the 13th fret again. So it should sound like this. Then we move to the second string, uh, 17th fret. Okay, back to the first string, 15 to 13th fret. And then the 17th fret on the second string again. So, so far we have this. Then moving to the 15th fret on the 2nd string. And then um, we do the pull off sequence on the 2nd string. So set that's 17, 15 and 13th fret. Uh. Then um, lastly to the 15th, 15th fret on the 3rd string. Then 15th fret pull off to the 13th fret on the 2nd string. Back to the 15th fret on the 3rd string. And then 14th fret on the third string. So that's going to sound like this. Yep. Okay, so that was the whole uh, playthrough slash tutorial of the solo. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, do remember to subscribe to our channel if you like this tutorial and give us a thumbs up. Thank you very much.